Hi, everybody. It's Wednesday, six o'clock. It's time for live. And I'm so excited because today we're going to be speaking about the Lionsgate portal. This is one of the most, if not the most important uh, spiritual date in our spiritual calendar. So I'm, I'm very, very excited. So the Lionsgate portal goes from July 26 to till August 12th of every year, it's energy peaking on August 8th. But why is this important? The Lion's Gate is a cosmic alignment uh, when the Earth, uh, the star Sirius, and Orion's belt align. In ancient Egypt, uh, uh, this was known as the Galactic New Year. So what the portal means is that we're becoming in alignment with the star Sirius. Um, and Sirius is a very high vibrational sun. So it's like our sun getting aligned with its higher self. How cool is that? Also, Sirius is a superstar. It's 20 times, 20 times brighter than our sun. Uh, when in alignment with Sirius in this portal, a tremendous amount of light comes into the planet. So we're going to feel the effects of the Lion's Gate until the end of the year. If you work with me, you've heard me say time and time and time again that light workers this year specifically have been experiencing a lot of tower moments. All of us are experiencing incredibly hard life situations. And this year is a year eight. Eight means self and abundance, among other things. So I expected uh, at the end of 2023, I expected this year to be magnificent. But what I and the great majority of the light workers I know is experiencing is that we're going through hard, very hard life experiences, especially things that we did not see coming, things that kind of blindsided us. Um, so what the heck happened with our magnificent year? What is happening is that the universe is pushing us to get rid of things, people, environments, and situations that no longer serve us. So we can focus then on the self and reach our potential. And the universe is now being very gentle with this. Um, if we, if you and I have been ignoring those things, people, places that we need to leave behind, the universe is like, nope, it's time, boom. Just like that. Basically, we have taken a deep dive into the shadow work in the first part of the year to figure out if our life was in alignment. We were asked to reevaluate relationships, our careers, our environment. We were asked to reevaluate everything. So we've done a tremendous amount of shadow work this year and it's been painful. Um, but it's been an amazing year also. If you think about it, you can find all the ways that you have grown and all the blessings that surround you. If anything, you have survived. You're still here standing strong, even if you don't feel like it. Um, so this year, Lionsgate is extra special. This year on August, month eight, the eighth day and 2024 is year eight is going to be eight, eight, eight. And this lion gate will bring in abundance. It's going to bring in greater manifestation, abilities, and more than anything, spiritual healing. So you may have noticed in prior weeks uh, that we have been experiencing tests coming up on your spiritual path. We have also felt as very extra, uh, very strong timeline shifts. Um, all these experiences at some point, you will look back on, ponder, reflect on, 
and then understand. And you may very well feel gratitude and appreciation for what happened because you will feel, now I know what I want. Now I know what I don't want, which is just as important. Now I know who I align with. Now I know who I am. And this is in the way that you can focus on the self. And this is the flow of the energy that we want is very potent uh, integration time for life for light workers. So, so many of us in multiple levels and throughout this test, uh, these experiences we're going um, are going to bring us further into alignment, into that flow of who we are, who are meant to be and why we are here. So why are we here? We are here to be happy and to serve. We are here to shine and anchor our light into this planet. And throughout this process, all of our lights together, because we're working together as one, it increased the earth vibration, not only ours, but the collectives and the earth. Um, so bringing up the frequency as we embody more light and we flow into this new earth timelines and throughout this whole integration process, the energy that we are right in right here, right now. Uh, so that's also why this portal is so important because of the light that comes into the earth and all that energy, all that vibration is going to change us. There's no ifs and buts about this. We're going to come aligned with ourselves, our path, our new earth, and each other. The sun is going to come out every day, whether you're aware of it or not. Um, same with this. You, whether you're aware of the energy flowing to the earth or not, it's going to affect you. It's going to change you. But if you're aware, you can work with it to your advantage. Um, so for some, uh, you may need to take a step back and be in hermit mode, allow yourself to be in silence. For some, the downloads are gonna come in fast and furious. There, no, there's no right or wrong way to do this. So honor your body, honor how you feel and go with the flow. This is where we're at. We are at this integration process and we're about to flow into this very potent landscape. And you may notice your creativity levels of your manifestation arising, your spiritual healing, um, all that occurs. You have, because we have let go of so much for as we continue to flow through this energy, you may also have physical sensations that come up and, and released for we are aligned to these new earth frequencies now. Uh, you may notice also your dreams have increased. I'm having disturbing dreams or scary dreams. I myself have had the weirdest dreams ever. Not scary, just bizarre to the point that I cannot explain them at all. Um, whatever skills you have, um, you already... Um, may will become magnified in this landscape portal um so this is a great time of change upheaval there's a lot of change and upheaval in the 3d um and as we flow towards the new earth timelines um magic is happening magic is happening everywhere so let me tell you this portal is about embracing who you are letting go of what no longer serves us and, in, and embracing who we are meant to be because we are going to become that. Um, and that's why, that's what this important is coming in to do, to show us that there is a light at the end of the tunnel, that we're perfectly fine, that we're, we're not just being rescued, we're being trained, to be more powerful. Um, 
the light and the energy of the Lionsgate portal will continue to impact us for the rest of the year. And that's going to be amazing. So right now, uh, what we're being called to, uh, the big thing, the big theme that I'm receiving uh, for this light portal is that it's all about personal power. At this moment, as uh, we're finishing going into that depth uh, and going into the pit, as we're finishing up the work, uh, that what this light of Sirius is doing is illuminating the remnants, maybe the last few little bits of the wounding that we haven't healed yet. Uh, what this slide is doing is asking us to finally heal the last little blockages that are preventing us from coming into our power. Because that's the theme, personal power. So ask yourself, in what ways have I been keeping myself small? In what ways have I not believed in myself? In what ways do I talk to myself down and make myself small? I'm very excited because this Lion Gates portal is a tipping point um, into the new energy. And I'm very excited because 2024 has been heavy, heavy, heavy. So this is the tipping point. It's going to start changing. You're not going to see a, an incredible change from one day to the next. It's going to be, you know, you know, things is going to go slow, but steady um, for the rest of the year. So let the serious energy, let the lion's gate portal energy start to seep into your system. Don't be afraid to go deeper into that shadow work. The deeper you go, the more light light is gonna come in uh, you now. Uh, so this is also why I uh, did the meditation and energy activation for the seven portal in preparation for this one. If you missed it, it's okay. It's in the group. Uh, you can go today or tomorrow. Um, and then on Thursday, August 8th at 11 o'clock Eastern time, I will do another completely free meditation and energy activation uh, for this powerful, powerful energy. And we are going to be removing blocks. Everybody got blocks. I got blocks. Everybody has blocks. So we're going to be removing blocks, utilizing all the lessons that we have learned throughout the year, throughout our entire lifetime, preparing us for this moment. Um, so if... Anybody have any question? Now is the time to ask those. <laughs> no? Okay. So I hope this has been uh, helpful. Let me know in the comments below if you have questions later on. And I'll be posting uh, the link for the live for August 8th. Um, if you you can make the live, that's okay. I know it's going to be in the middle of the day. People are going to be working. Um, but I'm going to be, um, you know, putting it as, as soon as the as, as the recording is available. Um, but do it as soon as you can so you can um, harness as much as the energy as you can. So don't wait a couple weeks. Try to do it on that day. Um, but our energies, whenever you do it, our energies are going to unite and make it even, even a stronger presence. And that's only going to help you and help the collective and of course the earth. So thank you for being here and I'll see you next Wednesday for another live.